Hello, it's been a long time since I've made any videos for the channel and I've just installed Pop OS which I'm loving. I'm running it on my laptop and I've just installed it as my second OS on my desktop machine. So this video I'm just going to show how to install SnapD and then how to install a Snap package. So what you'd like to do, because it does not come with Snap install by default so go to the terminal and you would like to type in sudo sudo however you want to say that apt update to get everything updated and all the new files installed there we go and yours might be running a bit longer, depends on the last time you updated your package just and mm, pardon me. Now we're gonna install SnapD, so cd apt install snapd, press enter. It's gonna ask you do you want to continue? And you say yes and install that quickly. might take a while I'm still waiting for my fiber line to be installed which will hopefully happen in the next few weeks they say two weeks but I haven't heard anything since last week so we'll see and the cool thing is there's a snapcraft.io website where you can actually go and look for snaps so the reason you want to use snaps in my understanding at least is it's packaged in a little snap package and it's automatically updated so the application you installed using snaps gets updated automatically with all its dependencies and all those things in a little package so you don't have the dependency issue when trying to install applications like in the olden days if I can say olden days okay right so now we've got snap D installed so I think let's see snap find discord so if you're looking for a package or application you can just use from the terminal snap find and the name of the application so there you can see there's discord there one one voice and text chat for gamers and that's the one i want to install now you can also check on the website which i'll show you now on which applications are available as a snap so you want to go snap install and the application name and add your password so there's another way you can log into snap I think website or something like that with your Ubuntu account and then you do not need to use the sudo or sudo in front of your commandlet um, that that makes it a bit easier so I prefer just using sudo because then I know as root I'm going to run it quickly and install it I don't want to sit with two-factor authentication stuff at the moment so let's wait for this to install while that's running let's open a web browser and where you want to go is to snapcraft.io forward slash store and here you can see all the available applications and they're categorized as snaps so some of these I've actually installed without using snaps but this is a very cool website most of the applications I use has actually been snapped if I can call that so this is the one we just installed here discord so I'm just going to minimize this and it's still busy installing snap so I'm just going to pause for now till it's finished to show you the outcome so now you can see here it's connected to discord it's getting a few files and settings and all that and we are done so we should now actually see discord 
Okay, so I had to Google this quickly. Uh, I need to do a snap run Discord. And that should open Discord for me. Okay, so it's failed to load three modules. It says starting updater, so we'll see what it comes back with. There we go. And there we go, Discord has been installed. So yeah, in this video is just to show you quickly how to install SnapD, pardon me, and how to install the package in, uh, as a snap. So that's it. I know how to install SnapD. Uh, this is for Pop! OS, but it should work for any Ubuntu derivative. And here's the website again for snapcraft.io forward slash store. I'll just give you an example. Click on a category and just browse through the website on what you'd like to install as a snap or like I showed in the terminal, just type in snap find and say postman if you want to see if it's available as a snap. Thanks for watching. I'll hopefully be making a few more videos in future. Thanks. Bye-bye.